Inspiring Girls Connecting Futures. That was the theme of International Women's Day held on the 8th of March. To celebrate, CityJet decided to get involved and help inspire some young girls by introducing them to careers that are not traditionally promoted for women. Starting with a morning briefing with CityJet pilots, 14 students from Loretto Secondary School in Balbriggan were invited to try their hand at flying CityJet's full motion flight simulator. Now what we're going to do is we're going to do a turn. So you're going to turn to your left. What was it like flying the simulator? It was absolutely amazing. We just I got to take off and it was so real. Um, really like, oh it's just so good. It makes me really want to be a pilot now. Oh yeah, it was really good. I got to do um, the turns and it's like so hard. I didn't know it was so heavy to like pull the airplane back. So it's really good. It's amazing, like Susie. I didn't expect it to be so lifelike. It's just, you know, the graphics and everything. It really did feel like you were actually flying. I love the most was uh, you can actually feel it in your stomach, like the whole sensation of actually flying, which I thought was the best. It really felt like you're on an airplane, and it was just amazing because you got to actually like fly a plane. You know, you would never get that. Like, what was the best bit? Uh, well, I had to ascend the plane up into the air, so that was really exciting. Now I loved climbing from um, five thousand feet to seven thousand feet because I had to just pull back really slowly. So that was fun. I did the takeoff, so obviously when I was like the actual. First taking off was the best part, like you know, seeing the runway and then you know turning and everything like that was the best. So. Actually getting to land, flying a bit like was good fun, but um, I think the landing was more fun, it was more exciting as well. In the spirit of International Women's Day, CityJet invited girls from secondary schools in County Westmeath to assist with the day's filming. I've always been interested in broadcasting and journalism, so being able to work alongside the filming team has really, you know, helped me and given me a feel for what it's like, but it's also opened my eyes to a possible career in aviation. I've always thought of it as, you know, a male kind of role, but seeing, you know, Sheena, the female pilot, and all these other girls having a go, it's really opened my eyes to this, and I, I could, I would consider doing it in the future. How did the students perform? They did great. They listened to exactly what I was telling them, and they followed on with the controls, and they, they really seemed to enjoy it and work well with it. What made you decide to become a pilot? Probably my first flight, I was about 12 when I went on a first uh, flight with my family and from then on it was a decision I kind of, my parents kept saying what do you want to do and I said I want to be a pilot and they kind of said oh right okay and then from there I kept on continuing on the whole way through school, I did engineering and physics and then I went on to study engineering originally just to have a degree and then I got the opportunity to flying with CityJet and went down and lived in South Africa for a year, trained there and it was definitely exactly what I wanted to do. Would advise if you are interested to go on a little flight in Weston or something for half an hour just to get a feel for it. Make sure that's what I'd like to do. That's what I did and it was definitely the best idea. What would you say to young women thinking about a career in aviation? Definitely. It's not a difficult thing to get into. It's just concentrating on your studies. Physics and the sciences will be a big thing on your maths as well. It's a nice path to go on if you're hard working and you're willing to try. It's not that difficult to do and uh, definitely go for it. Need more women in the in the aviation business. <laughs> Following the sim training, the girls travelled to our hangar, where they were given a tour by CityJet engineers, who answered questions about their careers and the workings of a jet aircraft. So hopefully, by showing them the sim and showing them the hangar, that we've been able to inspire them in their future endeavours. CityJet also arranged to have all available female pilots in the flight deck on the 8th of March to help commemorate the day. Inspiring girls, connecting futures is today's theme. I'm sure everybody has left with some inspiration. We're flying into another plane! Oh no. <laughs>